This way, just look on that way. You want to look at you? Yeah, look, Ben. <laughs> there you go. There. Ah, there. hello. <laughs> Zapera. Hello. You're right. You'll be running around in no prayers. Marlene Rubanja lives and works in Alice Springs. She lives in Lara Pinta Town Camp and she goes to Yaranje Altair Art Centre where she does these amazing weavings. The amazing thing about Marlene and the reason that I chose her for Badu Gili is her charisma and her charm and her sense of humour. This woman has a dilly bag on her head for no particular reason, which I think is hilarious. Why did you decide to put it on her head? I uh, might be walking around in the hot sun. Well, she need a hat, but I haven't put that one now. <laughs> when you found out that we wanted to put her on the opera house, how did you feel? I got shocked. And I've been thinking, oh, I was, and when I seen him, see her, uh, walking and showed on the computer I can't be she's walking what animated her she dances around or cheeky on there yeah. your creation cheeky one number. oh <laughs> so <laughs> <weird>. <laughs> The animators really thought about the process that each artist goes through. So when we get introduced to her work, it's these lovely loops of the wool that she uses and they kind of part to show little Nyap and Yanka. And she peeps through these little woven areas and then dances across the sails. I think it's just so great that they've tried to capture both her practice, the materials that she uses and her sense of humour in that one animation. We actually use some really interesting techniques, um, photogrammetry and, and motion capture. So what photogrammetry is, is 360 degree photo capture around a 3D object. We stitch all those photos together and then we are enabled to create a 3D model. We then go character rigging so we can actually create an internal skeleton for this 3D figure. And to create the movement, our animator actually got into a motion capture suit so in real time was able to experiment with doing high kicks, spins and turns, which was actually quite fun and, and a, a much faster process than traditional uh, 3D animation. I think she's tired from running around opera house. I seen her running up and down and jumping up and running, turn around again. I think you're tired, eh? She just been rehearsing, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm really proud of my work to tell you, Mop. Are you proud of yourself? I'm proud of myself too. I was gonna say that because you said it in the next. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm proud of my work. I'm not proud of myself, what I'm doing. I'm going to keep on going, sewing, sewing.
All right. Look after this one. Hey. Right?